Hey everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In our last video, we discussed six of twelve different types of QR codes: website URL QR code, PDF QR code, image QR code, Google Maps QR code, App Store QR code, and wedding QR code. In case you missed it, the link is in the description below. In this video, we'll discuss the remaining six QR code categories. Here we go. Number seven. Business card QR code. This one is for all the professionals out there. Whenever you meet people at a formal setup like a seminar, conference, or workshop, you give them your business card. You want them to save you as a contact on their phones, and a business card QR code increases their likelihood of doing so. How? Well, they no longer need to open their phone's contact app, tediously type your details, and finally hit save. All they now need to do is scan the QR code and click Add to Contacts. That simple. Number eight, event QR code. In the last video, you saw what a wedding QR code does. An event QR code is quite similar to it. However, it can be created for any event, maybe an informal event such as a party or a formal event like a workshop. Just add an event QR code to your invitation cards and help the guests save the event on their phones. Get the exact venue location on Google Maps and even watch a video. It'll also help you get them to RSVP easily. Number nine, audio QR code. Just like an image QR code, you can also make people listen to an audio file using an audio QR code. For example, monuments now use audio QR codes to provide audio information. Visitors in these monuments can simply use their smartphones to scan. No need to rent audio guides that are bulky and expensive. Number ten, social media profile. What's the first thing that you need to promote or market your services on social media? Followers, right? If you hand out flyers, brochures, or magazines to acquire followers, you can get some of the audience to follow you. A social media QR code helps you increase your conversion here. People don't need to manually type your social media handle to find your profile and follow you. They just need to scan the QR code, select their favorite social media site, and follow you. You know, the simpler the process, the better it is. Number eleven, rich text. Say you need to show a product's detailed information or user manual or technical specifications to the end users. What would you need here? A mobile optimized landing page, right? And to get one, you need a developer. Well, actually not. A rich text QR code helps you do it yourself. You can enter the text that you want and format it as you like. Simple as that. Number twelve, simple text. Just like a rich text QR code, simple text QR code also helps you show text-based content to your end users. But the difference is, it cannot be formatted. And while rich text QR code is dynamic in nature, simple text is static. To know more about static and dynamic QR codes, refer to the link in the description. You can use a simple text QR code for use cases such as inventory tracking, giving coupon codes, or answering questions. That's it. You now know what are the twelve different types of QR codes you can create and what each of them does. If you have any queries, ask them in the comments. If you find the video helpful, hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.